being able to visualize a sliced section of tissue, organ, or body region in both two and three dimensions is an important skill to develop as you begin studying anatomy. This knowledge can help improve your understanding of the relationship between different anatomical structures, as well as their position and orientation within a body region and in relation to other structures and regions. Planes are imaginary flat surfaces that are used to divide the body or body structures to better visualize internal anatomy. Sections are the actual physical cut or digitized slices of the body or its organs made along one of the planes. Sections are named according to the plane along which the cut is made. A sagittal plane is any vertical plane that divides the body or an organ into right and left sides. A mid-sagittal or median plane passes through the midline of the body or an organ and divides it into equal right and left halves. Here is a mid-sagittal plane that divides the head straight down the middle into equal right and left halves. They are mirror images of each other. We're looking at the right side of the head. A parasagittal plane divides the body or an organ into unequal right and left sides. This plane does not pass through the midline. A frontal or coronal plane divides the body or organ into an anterior or front half and a posterior or back half. A transverse plane divides the body or organ into a superior or upper half and an inferior or lower half. A transverse plane can also be called a horizontal or cross-sectional plane. The word transverse means across. And a transverse plane can divide the body or organ anywhere across its horizontal axis. An oblique plane is like a transverse plane, but it's tilted at an angle. It divides the body or organ in any diagonal direction. 